back again. A uh, couple more changes, last of the year. I guess that's one way to look at it. Uh, I replaced the original widget controls for uh, opacity and scale with these new uh, controls, duration and showtime. And you'll see how these work in a, a moment. If I click on one of these buttons, you'll see that the numbers change. So these numbers are coming from uh, these dictionaries located in this uh, background item file. And that first set, uh, I think I mentioned to you about the tens. Well, here they are. And these other numbers are basically used to set the duration, the amount of time it takes for the animation to run. That top group is for the 16.9s, and this group here is for the uh, 3 by 2 formats. And these numbers here are used to actually trigger this whole operation. And you can see they're different. And that's really about it. Uh, so what I've got here is a way to allow you to actually make changes without having to uh, edit the files, which actually works very well for me as well. So uh, I have put the duration up a little higher and you saw that when that happened it broke and when it's lower you get this uh, creeping uh, override there. I'm going to reset this again just to show you one thing here. So it's not much higher than when we started. I'm going to run it. It'll break someplace around here. But here's the thing now, here's the, uh, the addition. You're able to use the up and down arrow keys to change the uh, duration setting by uh, 0.05. It should give you plenty of control. It's still going to break. And we're going to do this one more time. I'm going to get it as close to the start as uh, I can and run it and it will go through. So you have that capability now and I think running this should make it a lot easier. When it comes to the uh, showtime variable, I wouldn't worry about it too much. Again, this is how many pixels before I start this whole operation, which is make a new one of these and launch it. Uh, and it seems to be working very well for the numbers that I've uh, chosen. And last, you have the factor here if you need it help speed things up a bit once you get things running. One last thing, if you want to save the changes you made, uh, you need to save it to a play file. And that's it.